Hi everyone! Today we're going to take a look at the best pre-built gaming PC in the market for this year. First, we're going to show you our top 10 best picks, and we'll talk about what you should look for before buying a pre-built gaming PC. You can find links to all of the products we've mentioned in this video down in the description below. Let's get started! At the first position of our list, we have CUK Continuum Gaming PC. If you have an extreme budget and you want to get a gaming computer that can handle anything you throw at, you might want to check out CUK Continuum Micro Gamer PC Desktop. It comes with a brand new powerful RTX 3090 24GB graphics card as well as an AMD Ryzen 9 5900X 12 core CPU. It also sports 64GB of DDR4 memory, a 1TB SSD, and an 850W gold power supply. In terms of performance, the 3090 and Ryzen 9 5900X combination are good enough to jump into 4K gaming or to push games on a 1440p 144HC Plus gaming monitor. If you're just looking to play games on a 1080p monitor, though, you could easily get away with spending a lot less, as even the budget-friendly Skydeck Kronos or iBuyPower Element desktops listed below should be able to max out most games at 1080p resolution. Ultimately, though, the Continuum desktop from CUK is one of only a few options out there that comes with both an RTX 3090 graphics card and an AMD Ryzen 9 5900X processor. If you want to build a gaming PC that will offer similar performance to this pre-built desktop, Check out our $2,000 gaming PC build. For a more mobile option, check out our guide on the best RTX 3080 laptops. Moving on to the next and number two with CUK Manny's gaming desktop. If you want to save a little bit of money and still be able to play games on a higher resolution monitor, like a 4K gaming monitor, or even on a 240HC monitor, the CUK Manny's desktop should also get the job done for you. The CUK Mantis comes with the following core components, a 10th generation Intel Core in an E11900K of processor, an RTX 3080 10GB graphics card, and 64GB of DDR4 memory. While the Mantis doesn't come with a higher-end RTX 3090 GPU like the CUK Continuum listed above, the RTX 3080 that it does come with will still be powerful enough to game at 1440p or 4K with higher frame rates. And the Mantis comes in at a significantly lower price than the Continuum. This system also comes with a 1TB SSD and 2TB HDD combination and an AIO cooler as well. Ultimately, if you're looking for the best gaming desktop under $4,000, this is definitely an option you'll want to consider. And for a comparable PC build, check out our $1,750 PC build to see our recommendations for similarly priced gaming laptops. Check out our guide on the best RTX 3070 laptops. The number three position is held by Skydeck Kronos Gaming PC. For our best value option, we chose the Skydeck Kronos because of the hardware it comes with and the price it comes in at. For just under $1,500, you get a PC that has the following components, an Intel Core Iceman 9700KF processor, an RTX 2066 GB GPU, and 16 GB of DDR4 memory. The combination is good enough to be able to jump into 4K gaming as well as max out anything on a 1080p monitor. This system also comes with a 1TB SSD, a 650 watt power supply, and a micro ATX tempered glass case that has a full-length PSU shroud in it. Ultimately, if you don't want to pay over $1,500 on a new gaming computer, the Skydeck Kronos offers a nice balance between price and performance. This system will still be able to max out anything you throw at it with no problems. You can check out our $1,000 gaming PC build for a DIY option that will perform similarly. Or, if you're considering a laptop as well, our guide on the best RTX 3060 laptops will help you find some similarly priced options. Next at number 4 we have iBuyPower Pro Gaming PC. If you're looking for the best affordable per built gaming PC, for just under $850 you can land the fairly powerful iBuyPower Pro. The iBuyPower Pro comes with an AMD Ryzen 5 3600 CPU an AMD Radeon RX 5500 XD6 GB graphics card, 16 GB of DDR4 memory, 
a 500 watt power supply, a 240 GBS SD, and a 1 TB HDD. This system is by no means capable of running games at 4K, but for 1080p gaming, this system will be able to max out pretty much anything you throw at it. And because it has an AMD GPU in it, you can pair it with an affordable 144 HD monitor with FreeSync for an ultra smooth in-game experience. The system also comes with RGB lights and a nice looking case that has a transparent side panel. Overall, for the price that this system comes in at and the performance it is able to deliver, it offers a phenomenal value for gamers that are looking for a solid desktop for 1080p gaming. If you're willing to build your own system, you can check out our $600 gaming PC build for a similar performing DIY option. The number 5 position is held by MSI MEG Trident Mini. The MSI MEG Trident might be a better fit for you if you want to get a small form factor gaming PC. This mini gaming desktop comes with the following components, an Intel Core Icefin 10700K CPU, an NVIDIA RTX 3070 GPU, 32 GB of DDR4 memory, and a 1 TB SSD. So, despite its smaller size, it is still able to fit a powerful RTX 3070 inside of it. And it also features a 10th generation Intel Core Icefin 10700K processor. The combination of the 10700K CPU and the 3070 GPU will be good enough to max out any game on a 1440p monitor. The MSI MEG Trident does come in at tilde $2,400, though. So if you don't need a compact system, I'd recommend saving some money to get the Skydeck Chronos listed above. However, if you like the smaller form factor that the MSI MEG Trident comes with, then this is one of the best mini gaming PC out there right now. The number six position is dominated by Skydeck Prism Roman 2 gaming PC. At right at tilde $4,000, the Skydeck Prism Roman 2 is a bit more affordable than our extreme pick, the CUK Continuum. Like the CUK Continuum, Skydeck's Prism Roman 2 desktop comes with extreme hardware. However, the Skydeck Prism Roman 2 opts for a slightly weaker AMD Ryzen 7 5800X CPU instead of the Ryzen 9 5900X that comes in the CUK Continuum. While both processors are excellent options, the Ryzen 9 5900X will offer better performance overall. However, for purely gaming purposes, the two CPU will perform similarly. So, if your main concern is gaming, you could opt for the slightly cheaper Skydeck Prism Roman 2 instead and save some money. Just like with the CUK Continuum, you'll want to pair this system with a G-Sync monitor for an incredibly smooth and game experience. In terms of storage, the Prism Roman 2 does come with the same size SSD, 1TB as the Continuum. It also comes with 32GB of memory, a cube-style case with tempered glass side panels and RGB lighting, and an 850-watt power supply. The bottom line is that both the Skydeck Prism Roman 2 and the CUK Continuum are excellent options. However, if you want to save tilde $700 and you don't mind sacrificing a little bit of CPU performance, then this desktop from Skydeck is probably the best option for you. If you need the extra CPU performance, then the CUK Continuum would be your best. Moving on to the next at number 7 with HP Omen Gaming PC. Another high-end option that won't quite cost as much as the CUK Continuum listed above is this HP Omen Gaming Desktop. This HP Omen system doesn't have the newest generation processor in it, but it does contain the both a powerful 10th generation CPU, in an E10850K and an Extreme RTX 3080 graphics card. That CPU-GPU combination will be powerful enough to run any game you throw at unmaxed settings with no problems. Whether you're playing on a 4K monitor or a 1440p 144HD display, this system also comes with 32 GB of RAM, a 1 TB SSD, and an 850 watt power supply. Ultimately, though, while this system won't quite match the performance of our top two options, the CUK Continuum and the CUK Mantis, it will still offer extreme gaming performance for quite a bit lower of a price. The number eight position is held by CyberPower PC Gamer Extreme. Next, we have the CyberPower PC Gamer Extreme. The CyberPower PC Gamer Xtreme is another budget-friendly pre-built desktop PC. 
So, if you want another option to consider alongside the iBuyPower Element or Skyda Kronos, this one fits the bill. The CyberPower PC Gamer Xtreme comes with these components, an Intel Core i5 10400F processor, an NVIDIA GTX 1660 Super 6 GB graphics card, 8 GB of DDR4 memory, and a 500 GB SSD. In terms of gaming performance, the combination of the Intel Core i5 10400F CPU and the GTX 1660 Super GPU should be powerful enough to handle any game on a budget-friendly 1080p monitor, or even on a higher resolution 1440p monitor. In fact, this system will perform similarly to the iBuyPower element in most games, despite being till to $150 less expensive. Ultimately, though, either the CyberPower PC Xtreme or the iBuyPower Element are worthy options to consider if you're looking for a cheap desktop that can handle any game you throw at it. If you're just looking to play at 1080p resolution, both options will work well. Next at number 9, we have Zodiac Mech Mini Gaming PC. If you want to get a mini gaming PC, but you don't want to spend over $2,000 on the MSI MEG Trident, then the Zodiac Mech Mini might be a better option for you. It won't offer nearly as much performance as the MSI MEG Trident, but with an Intel Core F9400F CPU, an NVIDIA RTX 2060 GPU, and 16 GB of memory, it will anything you throw at it with no problems. And it costs nearly tilde $900, less than the MSI MEG Trident, too. Of course, though for the same price you can get the Skydeck Kronos, which while it isn't a mini desktop, it has a better CPU and GPU. In the end, though, if you're set on getting a compact desktop, but you don't want to spend the amount it will take to get the MSI MEG Trident, the Zodiac Mech Mini Gaming Desktop is probably the next best option for you. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by VR Ready HP Pavilion Gaming PC Desktop Computer. The people looking for a cheap and good PC for gaming found their preference in HP Pavilion. They get a competent PC with really great graphic cards and a fantastic deal for a mid-level gaming PC. Any applied BIOS flash or firmware updates and all installed Windows showed no issue to customers. Gamers mostly prefer it for its cheaper rate. No game cannot run at max settings at less than 6 diffs. It gives good performance for competitive games and pleases gamers. It has packed extreme power. It is all about smooth performance and crisp graphics, which are wrapped up in bold design. This machine offers the latest technology and can upgrade, keeping the performance up to date. This PC is powered by NVIDIA Pascal architecture. If you are looking for the best bang for your buck of a mid-level entry gaming PC that can handle high to ultra settings in most games on a budget, then come to Pavilion Desktop. It is a good gaming PC, so gamers enjoyed it the most. It worked well and proved itself worthy for gaming and ran all the VR games exceedingly well. All games can be played relatively quietly and stay calm, and that's why gamers like it. Additional data storage is not speed sensitive and adds to the thrill of the game. Every game lover can purchase it because of its being budget friendly to enjoy more demanding games. That's all for today. We upload computer and accessories product review videos every single day. So don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.